Alright guys, how's it going? Hey, I just wanted to go through a new feature that's in uh, the SAM build 3.3, the newest one that's out right now. Uh, it's pretty cool. If you want to run a B2S file and a pup pack of the same table, um, this gives you that, that option and that freedom. It's actually pretty easy, so we're just going to run through in a, you know, three, four steps, and I'll, I'll show you how to make it work. So what you want to do is you want to go into your Visual Pinball VPM main folder and you're going to see a VPM alias dot text. And if it's not created, create it on your own. And uh, you're going to want to edit it. Edit it with Notepad or Notepad++ or do whatever you want. Um, here's the, the defaults that, that they've created for us as examples. Um, but for this example, we're going to use an X-Men table. Um, so we're going to name it My X-Men, and then the actual table is named XMN underscore 151H, right? So we're going to type My X-Men, comma, XMN underscore 151H and save it. All right, so that's good. It's the first piece we need. Second piece we need, we've got to load up our table, X-Men, whatever you're loading. Hit the scripts. And then we're going to be brought into this. Right? So let's scroll down and, oh, look, there it is. That was the ROM that we were using for our pup pack, right? So now we're going to name it My X-Men. Save it. That's it. That's all we got to do there. Okay, so we're going to look at our table folder, and we're going to need to change this as well, and just say uh, no pup, because it doesn't really matter what your what your file name is, you can make your screen name something else. So if you create a different playlist in uh, pinup that says regular tables, and you have another one that uh, is pup packs, right? This will show up in your regular tables. You just take out the no pup, and it, you know, if you have the text showing, it's just gonna, just gonna show X Men LE. No big deal. That one's pretty easy. Uh, so once we get there, we'll we'll go back into the VPN main folder, hit our alt alt color, and let's scroll down to X Men. And we're gonna hit the 151H, and we're gonna copy it because this is a color table. And we're just going to paste that copy, and because we named it this way, we're going to go my X-Men. So when we start this table, now that it's a color table, it's going to start with our our no pup. The regular direct B2S will start, and we're good to go. And then if we want to go back into pup, where our other table is that we have mapped that's in our pup pack section, or whatever section or playlist that you want to put it in, it will start with the playlist. So basically all this is doing is creating an alias, right? That's what he said in the file. It's a VPM alias. It'll create an alias for whatever table. So, I mean, there's mouse in. I mean, we've got a lot of them now, right? And, and they're probably going to continue to roll out. So here we go. I mean, that that's it. It's a pretty easy, straightforward, you know, few step. Hopefully I didn't over-talk and make it too confusing, so. Let me know if you guys have any comments. We'll address them. Uh, any more examples that you may need, let's talk about it.